Frontier Markets Nigeria. I am Justina Okechuku. Here with a summary of how the markets performed at the close of trading. Now, end of week trading at the equities market tilted flattish as the NGX All Share Index inched up marginally by 0.01% to 46,964.23 basis points. Now, looking at the top five gainers, PZ Cousins was up 6.90%. Japal Gold rose 6.45%, FTN Coco was up 6.06%, Africa Prudentials was up 5.98%, and Niger Insurance rose 5.00%. On the losers list, Northern Nigeria Flower Mills was down 7.83%, FCMB was down 7.22%, Livestock Feeds was down 6.06%, Nimet Pharmaceuticals was down 3.68% and UPDC was down 3.30%. Meanwhile, for the NGS group, the share price climbed 2.17% to close at 23.950 cover per unit. With a total of 55 deals traded in 2.393 million shares worth 55.864 million naira. At the NASD OTC market, a total of 5.283 million shares valued at 75.227 million naira were traded. As the NSI rose 1.83% to 723.12 basis points. At the FMDQ Securities Exchange, a total of 32.581 billion naira worth of bonds, Nigerian Treasury bills and OMO papers were traded on the platform. While the central bank special bills for May 30, 2022 finished off with two deals worth 4 billion naira at a discount high of 3.10% and a low of 3.05%. At the iron e window, the naira depreciated against the US dollar by 0.08% to trade at 416 naira 33 copper per dollar while open repo rate declined by 6.71% to settle at 5.67%. Now to markets news. The Nigerian Exchange Limited delist Access Bank PLC in order to list the holding company Access Holdings PLC on the platform. VFD Group sells 3.407 million units of NGS Group shares at 25 naira 50 cover each. Fitting Healthcare PLC says its board of directors has approved a dividend payment of 1.04 billion naira. Cornerstone Insurance posts a gross premium rating of 20.92 billion naira in 2021. And that's all for you today on Frontier Markets Nigeria. Do join us again next time. I am Justina Okechuku. Bye for now.